Hello. Hello, Koshe. Hello. Can you hear me? Hello. Are you there? I cannot hear you, Koshe. Maybe you are muted. Can you hear me? You are muted. Hello, Koshe. Please unmute before you speak. I hope you are listening clearly. Okay, okay. How about right okay. now? Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you now. Okay. All right. I'm sorry. I forgot and I was uh, going out. <laughs> no, no, yeah, yeah. No problem. Me just yeah. All right. Um, we are in BDD Cucumber, right? Yep. Okay. Can you see my screen? Yep, I see it. Yep. Okay. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to create a new project. Just go to properties. Then, sorry. Uh, go to file. And uh, actually, Go to file, then it's not showing anything. Why? Okay, let me save and go out from here. Okay, <clears throat> click on file. And it's not giving me any option to create. Okay, create Java project. Instead of creating Java project, we are going to create a Maven project. Mm -hmm. Go to Maven and Maven project. Click on next. Then check in creating a simple project. And then again, next com dot facebook then name of the project is bdd cucumber cucumber Test. Remember one time we had the issue with the Java project? I don't know what you have. Uh, how did you fix it? Actually, in the latest version, it has been fixed automatically. Okay. Mm -hmm. But uh, one thing we have to remember, we have to use the same version. We cannot mix it up. Okay. Click on finish. Uh, the first one, BDD Cucumber Tests, this one, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Uh, this is fresh project. We don't have anything. <clears throat> okay. Just we create here dependencies. Dependencies. Then dependency, for dependency, we have to go to Maven repository, MVM, Maven repository, and click on the first link. Then just take 
VTT cucumber. And cucumber. We should take cucumber, IO cucumber, not info cukes, because info cukes is uh, old one. <clears throat> okay. And BDD cucumber, we can take 7.9. If we take 7.9, we have to take also 7.9 test NG. In case we don't have 7.9.0 test NG, we have to step down for 7.5.0. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm taking the latest one. Let's see whether we have the latest one, two in test NG. Then just paste here. I'm going to take cucumber test ng. Cucumber test ng. 7.9 is available. I'm taking the same version. And we need also selenium java. <clears throat> Selenium dot Java. Selenium Java. Taking the latest one. I think that's all about. I just want to format it and then right button click and save it. I have Selenium Java, I have Cucumber Java, and I have Cucumber Test Engine. We are integrating test ng with cucumber. Okay. This is the mm -hmm. latest one. And what we can do, we can go to help, then go to Eclipse Marketplace and type cucumber. <clears throat> Cucumber Eclipse plugin is installed. In your case, if it is not installed, you have to install it. Okay. This is the plugin that were creating problem. Okay. This one, natural 0 0.9. Mm -hmm. But in latest VDD Cucumber and um, Cucumber test ng we can work without this natural plugin okay we don't need it so the problem gone okay <clears throat> got it but i thought that's what we tried to do 0 0.09 last time okay did you try no i haven't to be honest no okay so we can just save it and now, Maven dependency is not yet here, so we better right button click, go to Maven, and update project. 
whenever you change something in Maven, you have to update it. Mm -hmm. Then force update of snapshots. Click on OK. It's updating here. It was very quick um, for a couple of seconds. And Maven dependencies are here. But test ng is not yet here. So we have to go to project again, right button click, go to properties. Those showing test ng is here. Actually, it's not working because test ng software is not here yet. Go to library, then add library. And we see test ng is here. So click on next. Then click on finish. Test ng is not yet here. So you have to click on apply. When I click on apply, test ng already here <clears throat> in the project. Apply and close. Okay. Now we have to, earlier, we didn't need to convert the project into um, Cucumber, but now in the latest version, we have to right button click, go to configure, then we have to convert to Cucumber project. Are right. you following? Yep. When you click on convert to Cucumber project, a Cucumber icon will be here, a green icon. Okay, if the green icon is not here, then you have to again go to the configure and convert to Cucumber project. Mm -hmm. It's not showing though. Let us uh, refresh. Now green icon is there. <clears throat> okay. Mm -hmm. So the downloading and installation part done, okay? Now we can start our project. Now the first two packages are for the developers and uh, these two are for the test engineers or automation engineers or software development engineer in test. <clears throat> Since we are going to create first packages on steps, so I'm going to create a package steps. You can say steps or step definitions, no problem steps and steps here. I'm creating the step definition. Sorry, it's not step, it's feature. Let me I can actually delete it. It should be features. Where? Right here. Features. You can write feature files if you want, but features fine. <clears throat> okay. Mm -hmm. And I'm not creating this feature folder inside test slash Java because this resources are not Java. Features are not Java file, okay? That's why I'm not creating here, but you can do it too. But best practices are not to create feature files inside SRC slash test slash Java, but are you keep the Java files with test slash Java and other than Java files inside the resources. So inside the features file, I am going to create a feature file. 
it's a feature file is file, not Java class. Mm -hmm. okay? So I just name it login dot feature. Okay. I wrote it features because feature file can be more than one. It can be five, 10, 20, 50, even 100. Because <clears throat> some company love to create different features for different um, feature to be tested. Some companies love to keep more than one feature in single feature file. Like scenario can be two, three, even 50 in one feature, okay? In one feature can be 10. One can be positive testing, one can be negative testing, one can be semi-negative and so on. So, but maybe some uh, project leads, task lead, they love to create different features for uh, uh, different scenario. It uh, totally depends. Now I just take it out or I can take out everything. And I can say feature. Validate <clears throat> login functionality. And I can say scenario is test login functionality with incorrect credential. It can be correct credential too. Credentials. Okay, I can say validate login feature. with different credentials, meaning correct and incorrect. Okay. And I can start writing the test steps with Gherkin language. Gherkin language starts with condition, Mm -hmm. That is when, okay, when user is on the login page. It's not when, it's given. Given is the condition. Mm -hmm. The condition is the user should be in the login page. So to be in the login page, actually there will be two steps. One is uh, user have to open Google, then navigate to uh, the application he or she is going to test. And uh, when the same user, the user, 
enters incorrect username and continues the action okay when is action so given is condition and when is action and action continues the user enters incorrect pass and the user click on login button and what is the output what will be the result when user take all these actions then the user cannot be login application okay so these are Ger gherkin syntax okay so in interview question interviewers ask what is the speciality of gherkin language okay tell me something about tell me in brief about gherkin language gherkin language is english like language very similar to english mm -hmm. but it has some special syntax it starts with feature keyword mm -hmm. and it does have also scenario keyword scenario is nothing but uh test case test case combination actually yeah test case that contains multiple test steps mm -hmm. and it comes with gherkin syntax given when then what is given given is nothing but the condition the user must have to met before he start whatever he is going to take action then when uh, defines the actions and then is the outcome as a result of those actions meeting the conditions what outputs or results end result we are going to have then once we create feature file we have to create also step definition to map the feature file with um, we call it step step definitions or you can say just steps okay um, and i'm creating the steps inside src slash test slash java because inside steps we will be creating java file okay so this is login feature this is simply um, creating from file me, not me. java file but whatever we are writing inside steps or step definitions it will be java file okay so the point is we have to map this login feature with the step definition file okay we have to map it we have to glue this two file together okay 
you have to connect this file together. If it is not mapped, actually we cannot proceed with our framework. So first we have to run this feature file. When we run this feature file, it will provide us some code snippets that we have to implement. Before we implement it, we have to glue together these two uh, files. Glue meaning we have to map it, we have to connect it. So first right button click mm -hmm. and uh, you can click on pretty format if it is not formatted, except for example, it is uh, like uh, not indented, say for example, okay. Okay, something like that. When you right button click, there is pretty format. When you click on pretty format, it will indent it automatically, okay? Mm -hmm. Then run as cucumber feature. When you run it, it happens nothing. Still it is working, I think. Yeah, launching, yes. Actually, it's running. Uh, different, different. <laughs> it's running from different um, project. Okay, so what we have to do? Uh, we have to configure it. Okay. Let me do it. Make sure we are in the right configuration. So to do it, I believe I have to go to run as uh, without running it directly. We have to go. We have to go to run configuration. Then you see login feature, we have couple of login features. One is BDD test framework, but our project is BDD Cucumber mm -hmm. tests, right? Mm -hmm. So click on browse, choose BDD Cucumber test, this one, because I have some more Cucumber project and it's already with other project and it's running other projects. So I choose our project and then click on okay. Now it is BDD Cucumber tests, okay? And login feature, login feature, Actually, we are confused which one is ours. Mm -hmm. okay. Save the changes, configuration login feature. Okay, let me say this one is our Cucumber feature. BDD test framework, no, this one is ours. Uh -huh. Facebook functionality test, not this one, this one, okay. I think now it is okay. Login feature, mm, software engineer, da, 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 da. Facebook login functionality, no, not this one. Let's try this one. Uh, Cucumber tutorial, not this one too. Okay. Test framework. Let me just take out all this. 
darkness, confusing us. Great. Yeah, weird. Okay. If we have such a problem, then better we have to name separate. Okay. We can say login functionality dot feature so that it doesn't confuse us. Okay. I take out everything and now just save it. Right button click. Creative formats, right button click, run as cucumber, run configuration. And now let's see. Browse, BDD cucumber, test. Okay. Now login test. I hope it's okay now. Detected test in the version 7.4. We take 7.9. 7 we took 7.9, right? You see? Right. Yep. 7.9. But it's saying it's detected 7.4. Let us update it. Okay. It didn't say anything. Okay, let's try it. Launching login dot feature has encouraged encountered a problem. Run as cucumber feature. Let me delete some of the projects. Okay, I just save it. Right button click run as cucumber feature. L launching login dot feature has encountered problem. Launch configuration login dot feature reference non existing project BDD test framework. Actually, we are in BDD cucumber. Okay. Let's try again. run as run configuration bdd cucumber test and this one is facebook login functionality i don't know from where it is coming 
test SSC resource. Let's see. Facebook login functionality, SRC. Okay. Let's try again. It's running different file, not running our file. Okay, let me check where it is. We can check the location also. You can configure, okay. Job of your path. Just go to run configuration again. It should be inside documents, workspace. Okay, let me try with different name. Same name is showing. So I want to name a, I can refactor. And I want to name it login. Tests dot feature. Okay, since it is not mapped yet, it's showing with different color. Mm -hmm. Now let's see. Run is configuration. Login feature. This is not our feature. Since we name it login test dot feature, mm -hmm. so it's coming from different. So what is it complaining about? It's complaining about is this login dot feature is not our login feature. It's coming from somewhere else. You see, login dot feature. Our feature's name is login test dot feature. Mm. Okay. You can override it? Yeah, this is our project. I'm trying it, but it is not showing where it is coming from. Okay. Uh, I just take out this. But we need it. We need 